My dear friend Rupa Manjari, in the township of Raja, you are well known for your chastity. You don't even look at the faces of other men. It you is see, everyone is Manjari here. Give mine to me. <coughs> Give. Every, everyone is a Manjari, a gopi. Then man, why man? Female, look male. Right? Female, look male. And ma male, female. A male look female. So why is mentioned man? Why is mentioned man? You are chest. But I know one is a naughty boy here who not keep the chastity of the ladies. <laughs> His name is Govinda. His name is Mohan. He is still the heart of the all female of Braja. So you also attract with this male. You are chastai. You keep chastity. You are one pointed. You are pure. But this naughty boy, he never go. He go to everyone. And he still the heart of all the women in Braja. And he 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 bites the lips of others. Any more gopis. This is his job. But you are chastised because you are the Radha Hasti. You don't see even any boy, even the Krishna you not see. He has so purity. You never talk about him, never think about him. And you never want to talk, be with him. <laughs> In his spiritual consciousness, he has no physical identification. So Radha Dasyam, to be a devotee of Radhika, even you have to forget to think for Krishna. That is the really just the chastity of the Radha Dasi. There is not any spiritual world. Adi Purusham is a Krishna. In in your spiritual body. Who is the male? Krishna is the male. <coughs> it's not physical that there is any other male is there. He is the Adi Purusha. He is the, um, the Adi means the original man, Krishna. But Radha Dasi even not see this man who is Adi Purusha, who is the Supreme Lord. He, she has no interest for that. No thinking even. No dreaming even. This is the behind meaning. Ask yourself. 
then we become one point in Radha Das. That same Manjari. And this is the gift of Chaitanya. That this gift to us. It's uh, because it's because in our constitutional position we are all female. Right. This is my soul consciousness. When we identify soul, we become female. We identify body. We become male. We want to control. We want to suffer. This is male. Male suffer. Male get the pain. This is my material identification. We suffer and painful because we are we are doer. We are actor. <coughs> but here, I am not a doer. I am a viewer. I am a looking. What I am looking to my Swamini, my boss, who is the giver of love. <laughs> she is the ordinary goddess of love. Who love come from her. If you want to serve her, you have to take the center of her. First is the faith. Prabhupada writes in Bhagavad Gita 10, 10 when you are signed with Krishna, take the Bhagavad Gita, see that. When you are signed the Krishna, then alternative goal, no, no, no need. You have to see it, you see. We read many times. If you want to know, we have to see. We are signed. When we are signed Krishna, means we have no doubt in Krishna. Till I have a doubt, you will not increase your spiritual way. When there is no doubt in Krishna, then alternative goal come in life. I have goal. And that is how to be a loving, to learn the love and live in the love. When you understand this, like a, imagine my body. I'm telling because of you. My body. Body has a soul. Right? Yes. So I'm a body or soul. Huh? I am a soul. Soul. Soul, not body. Body is because of the soul. I am a soul. My soul has a body. The soul is the main. Then soul, when it goes to the spiritual world, I start meditating in the spiritual world. Then I start giving time for soul, not for material. Right? Then I start identifying that I am soul. 
when I see my soul, then I see soul in every living being. In my wife, in my child, in my family, everyone, everyone. So this soul when I see and my soul, then it is real love. When I see only body, is not love. Real love comes when I start looking higher than body. Then selfless service coming. If I see body, then I is condition and love. This condition is not fulfilled, my love is not there. Check. If you see the life of Jesus, his love was not conditional. Why? Because he see, he relate himself with the Father. And he see that everybody is the son of that Father. Maud is my brother and sister. Why? Because he see his soul as a son and he see his soul of every living. That is the divine vision of Jesus. Understand? <coughs> and this is the teaching of Jesus. Why is he said that love your neighbor? Who is the neighbor? Neighbor is sitting near to you, not a house neighbor. Anyone is near to you is your neighbor. Right? Love your neighbor. If I cannot love who is near to me, what is the use of taking life? Understand? <coughs> so it's spiritual life, love your neighbor. That is the spiritual life. In the spiritual life starts when I say love your neighbor. <coughs> so when I see the soul, I like to know super soul. That is Krishna. When I am not in soul consciousness, I am not interested to think for super soul. Or oh, I can think. Only I can be five become disturbed, this I can do. In this condition, I say, my faith is loose. I become hopeless. Right or not? Love is not. <coughs> so love can come. When there is a faith, there is a hope, then love is coming. So faith is this, that soul can hope to see the super soul. Super soul says, I cannot breathe to me if you have no love. You cannot do it. I believe with my philosophy that you are the goal of my life. Soul has a goal to super soul. Super soul say, no, 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 no. Without love, without your 
the spiritual body, you have, okay, you have a spiritual body. You know the soul, but you don't know the spiritual body has soul also. That is the love. That is Alladani Shakti, Swamini Radhika. Your soul is the spiritual body, soul is Radha. That love give you. Alladani, when you not take shelter of Alladani, you cannot reach to me. You cannot understand me. Love can give you understanding to see everything. So this is the pastime of the this consciousness people. The, what is the soup? My spiritual body soul to practice, to serve him. The spiritual body soul, not this material body soul. My spiritual body soul is Radhika. Super soul say without understanding this, without practicing this, you cannot understand. So do practice to be in loving, to serve in love, live in the love. Understand? Other thing is no meaning. So if you don't see, even the super soul, and you start looking to only your soul, a ladani shakti of somni, then you are chastised. You have a something more higher goal. When you do, when you are signed with Krishna, you agree with Krishna that you are the Creator Almighty. For you are the supreme. You are the everything for me. You have no doubt there. If the doubt is there, <coughs> I have no faith. Then I create myself hopelessness. I make confuse myself. My So when I'm assigning with Krishna and accepting that He is the Supreme Lord and the Supreme Controller, then I, I agree with that, that it is He and not me. Because the tendency of the soul in the material world is that we came to play God in the material world. We want to control and we want to enjoy. And to change that mentality into the female, means that we are the servitor and no more the controller. That is the beauty of the spiritual body. That is the beauty of material body. <coughs> if you want to be a controller, you want to be a boss, you want to, to be a hopeless, you live in material body and suffer. Right, Kishori? Yes. That means hopelessness will come. Hopelessness means I don't understand what to do now. <laughs> this is hopelessness. I don't find a way for that. And when you check, you are totally involved with the material circumstance. Mind is not clear, the reason coming to us. <coughs> Why?
money the material world where I can be attached with that and one is a spiritual world where I cannot attach we have to leave material attachment for spiritual This tendency exists not only in the man, it exists also in the woman. <coughs> right. When I am in the material identification, my body is female, but I act like a male. And we suffer, males suffer. <coughs> Female, less suffering. My, my male consciousness creates suffering inside. Sorry, <coughs> uh, My experience con persone che sono assorte in Maya with persons that are assorbed in Maya diciamo devoti assorbed we see, uh, I want to say devotees that are assorbed in Maya loro sono non soffrono, pensano di, di godere they do not suffer, they think that they are uh, um, enjoying, enjoying. enjoying. <coughs> Il loro orgoglio è così grosso che pensano di essere Dio. Their pride is so big they think to be God. That is right or wrong? E questo è giusto o sbagliato? Per me è sbagliato. To me is wrong. That is wrong. It is wrong. Eh, Because that is. Perché? We show a different way and do a different way. Noi mostriamo una cosa e ne facciamo una altra. We don't understand what is a spiritual world. Noi non comprendiamo cos'è il mondo spirituale. We find in material circumstances. Noi. And this is hypocrisy. Ci troviamo invece in circostanze materiali e questa è ipocrisia. It's spiritual means it's spiritual. <laughs> material means material. My hand means hand. My feet means my feet. My eyes means eyes. My senses means my senses. Reality has to be accepted. My soul means my soul. The spiritual world is a spiritual world. Right? He is already convinced. That is true. Now we have to convince. We are not a preacher. We have to practice to live in that way. We are not a teacher, we are not a preacher. This is the practice to do in our life to be conscious. We have to develop, we have to practice, we have to do it and realize it. One Vaidhi Bhakti or Raghu Bhakti. Vaidhi Bhakti, no need to realize. How much correct information you will be teacher. And you have to preach a whole world to make fool because I'm a fool. I want to make fool to others because I have no realization. 
And Raja Bhakti everywhere means honest to it. Honest to it. I don't want to make fool to others. And when I'm a fool, I can make fool. So I want not to be a teacher. I want to be, not to be a fool. I want to realize and live in the realization. I can do or not do, that is my not business. <laughs> but I want to be realized and live in my purity. First time, fix it. You want to do this, I want to be a preacher. If you want to be a preacher, and without realization, you cannot be a preacher for some time, sure. You can do it, but without realization, it will be empty vessel. Empty vessel. So realization of the subject is important. Why I take time? Only one subject. When you will realize it, you will develop the test in that realization and you will want to realize every subject what is you like it. And really, gathering information is no meaningful. One realization will make your life tasteful. And you will try to realize every beautiful thing in your life. Realization will be your subject, and information is other subject you collect it. But you have no idea about that. Because Guru did when. When we have realized something and then we share this with others, then we can touch the heart of the other person. Rather than this. Because sadhu sangha sadhu sangha sab sastra kaya. Lava matra sadhu sangha sab siddhi hai. Are lava matra. How sadhu sangha, all perfection will come. This is very foolish. How it can be possible in love matra sadhu sangha, all perfection will come. It is not foolish. The sadhu give you one point, one subject to realize. He is not giving you the. the information gather box to keep your mind polluted. You give one thing and you realize it. The moment you will realize one subject, you will develop the test for realization. And then you will start to realize every subject. And that is your subject. How all the thing you can realize in one time. The subject, what will come, you will start realization. You will practice to realize it. You will practice to realize it. You will not gather the information and this thing. You, that what you realize it is your subject. Because you connect with your spiritual master, and his spiritual master is talking through your mouth. You're not talking. This realization is the mercy of sadhus, is the mercy of your guru, that give you voice to explain that subject. <coughs> So in 
information is good or realization is good. So information is nothing when you start realizing this is your divine connection with your spiritual master. He navigates you. So love matra sadhu sangha samsiddhi hoi means you change your way of thinking. What? You will enter in the realization. This reminds me of one lecture of Srila Prabhupada. I think it was in Vrindavan. He said that to his disciples that the most important ingredient in executing one, one's bhajan is sincerity. Prabhupada words are very special because he is realized to a mere bhajan living in Vrindavan to a few years. He realized it. He do sadhu sangha. He practiced it. That time in 50s, Vrindavan is only sadhus living. And that Sangha, his realization grow. And this is still, everything is happening because of his realizations, because of his information, not realization. So life moves in realization. His spiritual life is realized. Is, then it is a spiritual. See the Jesus word. His words are realized. Nobody can cut it. Why? He is self-realized. He is connected in loving exchange of his father. And he is in relation. He has a relation with his father because he's the son and his father. So two is important. One is the lover is important. One is beloved is important. Without lover and beloved it's not happening. And one is the teacher is important who brings for that understanding. Three are important. Lover, beloved, and lover. Without beloved, lover is no value. In the heart of beloved, lover is too much important. For son, father is very valuable. And for father, son is very valuable. But to understand the son and father, you need one guide who can bring you to understand that. And that is a master. Love is important. <coughs> so love is important. And beloved is important. Guru Dev say, teacher, teacher bring us to connect, unite. This is like I feel, this is Manjari. Manjari is connecting love and beloved. Yes. How I can control? <laughs> to whom I control? Beloved or lover? Mm. Only we can serve. Mm. We can serve. <coughs> we can see. We can relish. 
How I can be a doer? They are doers and I'm a viewer. This is the reality of life. Then how I work full day in company. When you will watch, by doing you can see that I'm a viewer. That is it. <coughs> then that moment you are physically doing. <laughs> <coughs> but you will see some energy is doing through me and I'm still looking. <coughs> I'm looking and physically what I am doing is doing through the others in my body. So that is divine vision. I am a doer. I do whole day, but I see myself viewer. Guru Dev, this is surrendering, right? This is surrendering. This is surrendering. This is surrendering. That I am doing what is coming, I do. But at the same time, I see it, I am not doing. I just I am viewing the mercy of her. That is divine vision. That is love matra sadhu sangha samsiddhi If I really surrender to the reality, then I become viewer. This vision comes from sadhu sangha. This is the point. This is even one, one moment some, some may realize. That point. <coughs> All day you work, all day you take care, but at the same time you watch yourself, you do nothing. It's a happening in your body, <coughs> but you are relaxed and doing viewing. Surprising. <laughs> this is a spiritual life. What if we are gathering information? What, how much I can gather? How much my small brain can feel? <laughs> mm, I have no idea. Mm. <coughs> it's all book of practice. Mm. Because information collection is collecting information that we cannot for still, you know, like a false ego there, and still kind of uh, purisha abhimai there. Mm -hmm. We are doing, I'm doing. And then Guru Dev saying, we, we cannot attend this kind of viewer, you know. So, so therefore, it's not surrendering, actually. Just, you know, ego is more increasing. When we can give up the attitude of being a controller, then we can live in that in that way. Otherwise, it's not possible. Because all the time we think, I am doing, I'm controlling the situation, and for that we are suffering, and actually we don't know that we are suffering. That is the problem. Huh? Yeah. We could also see reality. <coughs> because not the viewer, we are doers. This is the dark ignorance. And yesterday we are leading uh, to another P bus. Shikshashtakan, third bus. This is actually viewer's consciousness, viewer's point. All. All viewer. This is Sadhu Sangha. This is Sadhu Sangha. <laughs> this is the Sadhu Sangha. When I am a doer, I become viewer and do very nicely, mm. but as a viewer. Mm. I will not sit idle, more active. Mm. 
But as a viewer, what is instruction coming? I do this. But I view, wow, what you trying to say me, I do. I am your servant, servant, servant. So we are good. We are view. Uh, you are viewer. Therefore, everything you feel, this, this everything mercy of Guru Dev. This is always mercy of Radha Mohan because viewer. I never thank myself because I want to be viewer. Mm. <laughs> so, this is you are chastised with woman, then you can be a viewer. Hmm? Chastise? Means no uh -huh. desire. Chastity. Chastity. Uh -huh. Chastity. Uh -huh. If chastity is not there, you cannot be a viewer. Still, desires are there. Right? In spiritual life, I become soul. I soul body I have. But still, desires are there. So you have, enjoy mm, you have a desire, we cannot become viewer. Rade, rade. What to do? To be with my soul, be with my somni, to be identified a spiritual body soul. That is my somni, my boss. Without that, my spiritual body will not exist. If I forget you, my spiritual body will become. I will again come back to material body. So unless we become viewer, we cannot attain in Swaru Pasiji. How is possible? I am a doer than this. Yeah. This is it. This secret, day to day Buddha. Then, then is to then we understand more. Mahaprabhu said, "Kiba vipra kiba nyashi sudra kena." Jai Krishna Tattvata Sai Guru Hai. So we don't. It doesn't matter external external position, external body. Sanyasi, Kshatriya, Vaishya, Sudra, or man, man, lady, denouncing, household, it doesn't matter. If we become this, this viewer consciousness, this Swarpa consciousness, that person can become good. Real sense. So, but we are thinking, no, no, I am sannyasi, I am ma, I am brahman, therefore I can become a teacher. <laughs> we are thinking <laughs> that are all impediments. Yes, but actually blockage. Another ego is creating. That is a good thing I think I want to say. But we are so foolish, we are so conditioned. We don't understand, just we see external things. No, we want to be conditioned mm. to do something. Mm. Are I have a limitation for doing all Because of my gunas, my gunas means tamoguna, rajogunas, satoguna. My catch me mm. to be 
in condition. Our sanskara catches. Sometime I become angry. Sometime I become angry. Sometime fighting would come in. Sometime envy would come in. Sometime I'm the best. All coming inside me. What is this? Come, grow the low, more mathematics. Pride coming. Calm, crude, anger, mad, madness, madness, or kind of I'm the best. I'm the highest. Calm, crude, low, more, mad, like a drunk, drunk, mad, mad, serious, mad, serious, envy, envy coming. <coughs> yeah. Mm. That's why when you are in that uh, influence of the three material nature, you have to transcend it. How to understand? Here, transcend this. Please. This is uh, like this. You have to beyond that. Yeah. If you leave there, they will anyway come and catch us. If you want to be catched. They catch. This is the material nature of my body because this way they influence me. That beyond going out of that is intelligence. Uh, right? And what is the, is the need of the intelligence to discriminate? Yes. Right. And beyond the discrimination, this is the mind that is the net. Right. And then the soul. Yeah. Check yourself. <laughs> Which condition we are? <laughs> Which influence influences us? Mm. Mm. <laughs> you don't even look at the faces of other men. No desire. No desire. That is the purity of your chastity. Mm. No. You are a woman, girl. You want to search something else. Means you have a desire still something. You are not still. Purity is there. Oh. What a beautiful sharing. What a prayer to Guru. Oh, Guru Dev. Still you have no purity inside you. You still want to watch something else, inside something else. You become a man. That time also you are searching a woman. And now you become a woman. Your spiritual body, again you start searching man. Desires are not going yet. What is happening to you? <laughs> when you are man, you are searching a woman. And when you become woman, <laughs> your spiritual body is still your desires are there. Wow. 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 Amazing. Huh? So. Hmm? What, Gurudev? What is happening to you? <laughs> this happened is asking to the Guru. Still, how is beating your lips to it? You are a woman. <laughs> and there is nothing missing in your purity. 
who might you lead to them? You are a woman, some man come to bite your leg, but what? It is therefore surprising that your lips that are as beautiful as red bimba fruits have been bitten. Although your husband is not at home, has this maybe been done by the best of Paris? No, because Krishna cannot say it. So this is para Krishna many names. But everybody understands in Vrindavan. Krishna has many names. <laughs> One name is also parrot. <laughs> Parrots also sometimes bite lips. And that Brajvasi understand this is the Krishna parrot. Krishna become today parrot to fight. <laughs> Desires is still out there. <laughs> yeah. Explanations. According to Vaishnava researchers, yes, Vaishnava. Vaishnava. <coughs> researcher. According. Researcher, PhD. It's not ordinary book. Go on. According to Vaishnava researchers, this Vilapa Kusumanjali is the final writing of Srila Raghunatha Dasa Goswami. Yeah, P.S. <coughs> this book is a researcher book. It's not ordinary book. In fact, hmm. there is one director that they want to make a movie. I hear to this in Italy, and one director want to make a movie. Long time this project. Impossible. Impossible. To understand even. Well, I said they can make it. They want to make it. This is not a subject here. Yeah. So, yeah, it's a researcher. <coughs> researcher can go deep to realize. How much deep you are want to go in to depth? One is a swimming <coughs> in the river. Swimming is also two types. In the flow or against the flow. <laughs> in the flow, it's easy to swim. Mm. I guess the flow very difficult to swim. Mm. Right or not? Right or not? Yes. <coughs> so material world is against the flow we swim. Mm. Mm. And swimming in the flow is a spiritual world. And one is the same river somebody wants to dive in to collect the some stone, <laughs> some hidden things that without diving <coughs> they cannot get it. 
Diving means go deep in the river, ocean, <coughs> to collect the things, different mm. things. But diving, I have to know this diving meaning, flow meaning, swimming meaning. Wow. What we want to do? We want to be against flow, in flow, or we want to dive it to collect some joy. Wow. I am very satisfied to be in swimming on the. Swimming is collecting information. Mm. Diving is realization. Mm. One is material information. One is spiritual information. And diving means realization. Mm. Guru, there sometimes he feels satisfied, you know, and so is. Uh, but it's not so good when we feel satisfied. I mean, uh, it's like okay, I stop or I, I don't know. Satisfaction means I stop it. I stop. And not satisfaction. Greed is more for doing. And why we satisfy sometimes? Why we feel satis satisfaction in this? Uh, why we block in this satisfaction? Greed is less. Greed is less. Satisfied. Mm. Greed has to be more higher. Nara and Mara say you have to be greedy. Greedy, always we have to be greedy for the divine thing. We are greedy for material collection and this we get it, we satisfy it. Again greed comes from material. Is it like the material life is the opposite, no? Material, material greed, satisfaction coming. But the spiritual greed every day is growing more and more. We want to not to block myself. We want to increase it. That is the spiritual greed. More what to do, more what to do. What what service we can find? It. What service we can find? It. And one service, new service find, like she find samadhi seva service. It was very normal happening, but when you find the service, if they all will be interested, you will see it will be beautiful service. Like a Shiva service was normal service, but now you see how caring Shiva Puja <coughs> So you can make normal, and you can make beautiful. <laughs> when you fix that, automatic beauty will come. One more service growing. This way, many services grow here. We never plan, organize something. When it's good happening, we start pushing it. And it become prem prasad. 
it become medical seva it become a school children seva it become vaisadam seva like this flower seva automatic and it's it's more greedy more greedy to do service somebody likes to do somebody don't like to do good luck person like to do yeah go on this beautiful prayer can give us some insight into his intense feelings you see inside no outside uh. of his intense feelings of transcendental love and separation from his swami swami mistress or queen before he entered into sri sri radha krishna's eternal transcendental pastimes mm. in his sida swarupa wow. or manjari swarupa sri radha this is the preparation living on the bank of Sri Radha Kunda he was totally immersed in the ocean of lila rasa mm. wow and, mm. and he had forgotten all about his body and everything connected with it wow. being deeply absorbed in his swarupa visha mm-hmm. his awareness of his transcendental identity vila pakusu manjali enables us to hear him painfully weeping as a realized maid servant of Sri Matira Dharan wow. who is suffering separation from her swamini or mistress day and night each verse of this unique book is drenched by the tears coming out of the heart of Sri Raghunatha Das Goswami mm. that is afflicted by feelings of separation each flower like lamentation is filled with a honey of transcendental anguish the mm. mm. Sri Raghunatha Das Goswami personally revealed his mental condition in the opening verses of his Sri Radha Ashtottara Ashtottara Shatta Nama Stotra Not seeing her goddess the queen of Vrindavana a certain maid servant who considers her lotus feet the only goal of her life 
became very anxious, fell down at the shore of her lake, Radakunda, cried loudly out of pain, and just to see her beautiful face, sang these names. A person who is bereft of the treasure of bhajana cannot even imagine how these severe feelings of, separ of separation are. Srila Raghunatha Dasa Goswami was suffering because he felt deprived of the devotional service of his beloved deity, Srimati Radharani. And on top of that, his heart was wounded by the fire of separation from Srila Rupa and Sanatana Goswami. In Chaitanya Charitamrita it is written, there is no other misery in the world than separation from the devotees of Krishna. <coughs> in the eighth verse of his Svaniyama Dashaka, Srila Raghunatha Dasa Goswami gives some indication of this. Abandoned by my beloved Srila Rupa Goswami and Sri Swarupa Damodara, I have become completely blind and bereft of intelligence. Abundant by my beloved Srila Rupa Goswami and Sri Swarupa Damodara. I have become completely blind and bereft of intelligence. Even though they have disappeared, I am still alive and I am immersed in an ocean of great misery. This is because Rudev, this is because he lost their association. <laughs> Mm. 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 We see. We see. No association was. We see that they feel it. Abandoned by my beloveds. They abandoned me, so they forget me. They no help me. Sri Rupa Goswami and Sri Swarupa Damodara. I have become completely blind and bereft of intelligence, even though. They have disappeared. I am still alive. And I am immersed in an ocean of great misery. Holding a blade of grass between my teeth, 
I humbly and anxiously pray that Sri Gandharva Radha herself may now take me to her lotus feet. There is no other place where the severe heartache of separation can be cured than these lotus feet. Gradually, Srila Raghunatha Dasa Goswami ended up in a terrible condition. Sri Radha Balabhadasa, a Bengali Mahatma, has described Srila Dasa Goswami's condition <coughs> as follows. Srila Raghunatha Dasa Goswami had given up all sense enjoyment out of separation from Radha and Krishna. And he ate only dry, tasteless food. Then, out of separation from Lord Goranga, he gave up eating that solid food and he ate only fruits and milk. <coughs> then, when Sanatana Goswami left this world, he gave that up. He gave that up also and drank only water. Water is important, you see? When Rupa Goswami also left him, he even gave up drinking water and kept himself alive simply by saying the names of Radha and Krishna. When he could not see Sri Rupa Goswami and his devotees anymore, he began to cry, suffering from their separation. And when he could not hear them speaking about Krishna anymore, he loudly began to cry of grief. Radha Krishna, where are you? Where are you, Vishaka and Lalita? Please reveal yourself to me. Oh, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Oh, my Lord, Svarupa Damodara. O Lord, Rupa and Sanatana, day and night, Sri Raghunatha Dasa Goswami was crying like this, while his body and mind were burning, and his limbs were grayed by dust as he rolled around on the ground. He had become blind from fasting and he considered his old and worn 
out body to be a great burden out of these feelings of separation. Falling on the bank of Radha Kunda, he breathed out deeply, unable to say a word. His tongue moved slowly as tears of love fell from his eyes and he remembered Krishna. In such an anxious, pitiful mood of separation, Sri Raghunatha Dasa was crying Vilapa Kusumanjaya. Therefore, this book is the incomparable, relishable treasure of the practicing Raga Nuga devotees who are themselves also suffering separation from Sri Radha's lotus feet. Hence, for the Samavasana Samajika, the Rasika devotees, the practice of hearing and chanting these wonderful prayers is a beautiful means of Sadharani Karana, identifying oneself with a transcendental role model. Can you repeat this? Mm -hmm. <coughs> Hence, for the Rasika devotees, the practice of hearing and chanting these wonderful prayers is a beautiful means of Sadharani Karana, identifying oneself with a transcendental role model. Mm. <laughs> and will help them to attain an astonishing relish of Vipra Lamba Rasa, love and separation. <coughs> May I have a question, Maharaj? Uh, about this uh, Vipralama, these feelings of uh, yes, this pain. It, it, this is uh, like a spiritual, yes? Yeah? Spiritual feeling. But how can we understand that maybe sometime maybe uh, we think that we have some feeling like this, you know? But maybe we are cheating to ourselves for this material suffering and we can... Uh, <laughs> I don't want to say show, but we can... We cheat ourselves, maybe. And we want to co be convinced that it is real spiritual, but it is material. So how can we understand this? If it happened. <coughs> so, at the first, uh, we have to understand. The mic, please. Ah, sorry. <coughs> Krishna's leader, or even even in this material world and, and in this material world or even spiritual world to 
two things very important to increasing feeling and meeting and separating. So, like if we, we love somebody, then if we meet together, we become very happy. And then if we separate, we feel so sad, so much hankering is coming. So these two things, always in this material world and spiritual world. And material, this meeting, separation is thinking we are body. Our object, loving object or body, or for myself, this kind of material meeting and separation. Mm. It's also written the But this practice should be done in full awareness of one's Siddha Svarupa, spiritual body. So, <coughs> so Gurudev mentioned, we practicing Raga Bhakti, Raga Nuga Bhakti. Then, try to stay or aware in our spiritual body, Siddha Svarupa. Then, that observation has become intense or, or time is more longer. And if we get the mercy of Gurudev and the Nitai Goranga, or other Vaishnavas. <coughs> then spiritual feeling is coming, especially separation. Because in a Sadaka Deha, we could not see our Ishta Deva. So therefore, like in material world, we missing our lovers. Similarly, we missing Radhika very much. Some gopi is missing Krishna. So for our case, we are missing Radhika. This kind of separation feeling is Vipraramba. So this is actually how Mahaprabhu show us. And also how our Goswamis, six Goswamis, are showing us. But unfortunately, present moment, we are still bodily consciousness. Therefore, that feeling may be mixed, or material feeling, or maybe mixed. Then our bhajan is increasing. Our awareness is spiritual body is more increasing or intense. The one day we may we may experience this kind of spiritual separation. Like uh, Narotamada say, Goranga Bori Tehabe, Prakasha Nira, in this verse, in, in this poet song, the kind of feeling separation of Goranga, my body is kind of trembling. And my from eye, tear is coming. If one fortunate soul can do, even now also. But this is only possible. We have to forget this material bodily consciousness, or material attachment. So this is a kind of. You know, material and spiritual kind of feeling, but this Vipraganga feeling is 
is so much contained in the spirit of Sanjay. So therefore, if we are lead, if we lead here, day to day, and then that feeling come into our heart, and then we may we may feel or may more realize. The practice. <clears throat> the practice is now we are discussing and hearing this wonderful book and the meditation of Srila Raghunata Goswami. And then when we are practicing during, during our chanting, then we try to remember what we have heard and to go deep in that while chanting. The chanting will transport us in that world and more and more we can see what we are doing there and we are going more deep in that. And then you can feel it by yourself in your heart if that feelings are real or if it is only because your mind wants you to have that feeling. So, this will come out with time and with practicing. You will feel the real thing. I think if come is not your mind, it's your spirit <coughs> that you want to. The mind is not yes. controlled from the spirit. No, but his question was is my feeling real? Or it is. It is, it is not real. And how you can distinguish if it is a real feeling or if it is only like a mental speculation, for example? If we have material desire or bodily consciousness, it may be mixing or maybe not a real one. But also some, some very fortunate soul due to Sadhu Sangha, this kind of, if I say, bus, kind of, that feeling reflects us. At that time, we felt so much separation. Like, uh, from who? Hmm? From who you feel the separation? From spirit, like, uh, like uh, our Ishtadeva, or a very dear devotee of the Lord. That's a good thing. Like, uh, and then you start crying. Yeah, and then say like, uh, if we hear about a kind of pastime or a great devotee's pastime, and sometimes we feel so much separation, and sometimes cry, it, that is a very good symptom. But our problem is is not continue yet. We have not cry. So anyway, so if this feeling becomes twenty four seven, then perfection will come very soon or already perfect. That's my feeling, my understanding. Well, after that, we should come love, pray. May I say one thing? Yes. <coughs> <coughs> I, I think also that what said before Gurudev that we should always be this, the, those that are viewing. So, and, and first of all, we have to see ourselves. If we have this practice, we can see, and, and we are honest, we can see from our also behavior, feelings, if we are envious, if we are always criticizing others. This means that the feeling was not bona fide, was not sincere, or at least it was not completely sincere. What do you think, Maharaj? That this should, this is a way to understand if our feelings are real or not, are just a show, as Shamal said before. Allora, 
essere gli osservatori e quindi osservando noi stessi e quello che viene prodotto da questi sentimenti, quanta invidia c'è in noi, quanto bisogno di criticare gli altri c'è in noi, se questo è quasi questo è, è predominante, vuol dire che il sentimento o non è sincero o comunque è ancora molto misto. I think the dear one or a false one, we know, actually, we know ourselves, dear. And dear one coming from so much humbleness, so much hankering, so much devotional mood, no false ego. No bodily consciousness, no kind of expecting something like adoration, distinction. But if we expect something, or if we touch of material consciousness, that will be not real. But this practice should be done in full awareness of one Siddha Swarupa, spiritual body. A person who tries to relish these sweet mellows while feeling himself sitting in the prison house of the material body simply deceives himself. So this is a person who tries to relish these sweet mellows while feeling himself sitting in the prison house of the material body simply deceives himself. This in, in other words, this is material consciousness or ego consciousness. I think that's, that's say, while feeling himself sitting in the present house in the material body, simply deceived himself. This is, I feel, this is material consciousness. This is ahankara, ego consciousness. But the real one is beyond material consciousness and uh, very connected and uh, swarupa consciousness. And at that time, I feel ishita nishita, swarupa nishita. Or swarpa nishita, ishita nishita, guru nishita, it's there. It's written in Sanat Kumara Samhita. A practicing devotee should think himself to be amongst them, the other gopis, as an enchanting, beautiful, young, adolescent female. As a female associate of Radha and Krishna's girlfriend, she is dedicated to the services that are ordered to her 
and she is decorated with jeweled ornaments. So she is decorated with jeweled ornaments that are given to her by Sri Radha as remnants. I think this is an important point. Practicing devotee like us think myself, ourselves, to be among them, among them. <coughs> For us, we think my, ourselves to be a maid servant of Srimati Radha. Then, Radha Rani's maid servant is dedicated to the service here mentioned that are order to her. And she is decorated with jewel ornaments or even cross also by the prasada of Srimati Radha Rani. Means the maid servant of Radha Rani is covered or imbued the feeling of Srimati Radhika's mood or feeling and service attitude also. This is, this is Abhima, who am I, who I am. We are thinking, I am this body. I am from you know, Italy, Japan, Switzerland, Germany, etc. But uh, we are not this body. We are Radha Dasi. And Radha Dasi is dedicated to service of our, our Swami and also decorating Radha Raja's prasada. Or <coughs> In this verse, Srila Dasa Goswami offers a Sarasa Stava, tasty praise, to his own guru, Sri Rupa Manjari, in his own Siddhasvarupa. Yes. Then, then um, if I have understood on our meditation, we should think ourselves to be uh, Radha Dasi in the way that we just uh, read before. But uh, and, uh, as a sadhaka, we should feel like humble, like. Uh, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu says in Trinada Pisunichena, this is our, also our sadhaka practice. Otherwise, we may, if we think, I am the best because I am a Manjari, this is false, of course. What, what can I, I don't know, it is clear? Uh, uh, just I translate a little. <coughs> pratica meditativa dobbiamo pensare di essere degli ragazzi come è stato appena descritto però nel nostro corpo di sadhaka noi dobbiamo essere più umili possibile come ci ha insegnato Cetano Marlo e questo insomma no, è non pensare di essere chi si cioè i migliori questa è la domanda you can answer please ok so Bhaidi Bhakti is practicing in this Sadaka Deha only, generally speaking. But if we practice Raga Bhakti, Raga Noga Bhakti, we have two kinds of practice. 
in this sadhaka they had this 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 body's practice and siddha they have practice which is kind of uh, in meditation we are radha dasi so In this sadhaka deha, in this, in this practitioner, the devotee in this body, we are humble servant of our Guru Dev, <coughs> and uh, assisting uh, Mahaprabhu's uh, Mahaprabhu's movement, and in the Siddha deha. We are helping Radha Mohan's Lira, Krishna Lira, as, as, as Manjari Swarup or our Sita Deva. At that time, <coughs> our Guru Dev is become Guru Manjari. Sometimes instruction of Guru Manjari, or as, sometimes as friend. Together we are serving. Sometimes definitely serving. But uh, to, to helping, to pleasing Radhara. Radhara needs to fulfill desire of Radhara. This topic is so important. Don't be disturbed, otherwise, disconnect it. Please manage. So that is the difference. So therefore, our, our sadhana should be two kinds. In daily practice, we do working, but we thinking, this work is Radha's work. This family Radha Rani given to me. This money, this house, this car is given to Radha. So we, I'm not doing for myself. I'm taking care of Radha's property, Radha's, Radha's servant. Because my son, my daughter, my family member, all Radha runs property, Radha's made servant, reality. So in that consciousness we work, then 24-7 we are thinking we are Radha Dasi. And in a daily meditation, and we meditated in this lira, like in Bilabak Manjari. And uh, we want to help Radha and Mohan's meeting to please Radhika. At that time, always our Guru Manjari is near. So that kind of meditation. In this Sadaka Deha, also Guru Dev is always there. Always in, in my heart, what Guru Dev is always near. Sometimes Guru Dev, it seems far, but always live together in this consciousness. Then we do practice 24-7 for our sadhana. If we practice like this, then slowly, slowly our Swarupa will be manifest. That is humble, my answer. Is it okay? Alcuni anni fa sono 
sono andato da Gurudev e gli ho chiesto eh, come posso abbassare la mia lussuria e i miei desideri materiali. Some years ago I went to Gurudev and asked him how can I um, diminish, diminish, diminish my, my last desire, my material desire. E lui mi ha dato una pratica da fare and he gave to me a practice to do che l'ho fatta per molto tempo that, that I did for long time e, e mi ha funzionato mi ha funzionato and uh, this worked this practice worked e, io penso che qualsiasi problema noi abbiamo I think that whatever problem we have Dobbiamo andare umilmente dal Guru. We should go humbly to the Guru. E lui risolverà qualsiasi nostra difficoltà. And he will solve all our uh, difficulties. Perché lui è, perché questa è il suo, la sua missione. Because this is uh, his mission. Ed è impotenziato da Radha Krishna per poterlo fare. E è impowered by Radha e Mohan to do it. Radha e Krishna, Radha Mohan. È passato, è spiegato che il Guru soddisfa tutti i desideri di perfezione spirituale. It is explained that the Guru um, fulfill uh, all the desire of spiritual perfection. Questa è la mia esperienza. This is my experience. Anche attualmente. Even now. Yes. called Sarasa Stava because here Sri Guru Devi is a Priya Saki. The first three verses take place within one Lila. The same? The first three, the first three verses mm -hmm. take place within one lila. When the Swarupa Visha becomes very intense in the Sarakadeha, material body of the devotee, the devotee cannot be happy and satisfied anymore. With his, with his experiences during Smarana, dreams and visions, Spurana, as he was before. He wants more. Should we stop because of RT? Yeah, this is very important So this Raghunanda Goswami was doing meditation. And uh, this Sumarana was sometimes to leave. Some visions coming. The spiritual vision called the spirity. <coughs> and more clear vision is called the be spirity. But uh, still not satisfied yet. Because, say, if we have rubber, you know, we. We dream Raba with Raba, mm. or some vision come, or maybe we see picture, or video. 
but we are not satisfied because we need that my lover in front of me I want to hug you I want to touch you I want to talk to you I want to serve you this kind of real connection is, is desire is more increasing and if our deity is come in front of us. It is called the Shaksha Darshan. So this this Lagnardas Goswami is wanted. We also want it. So this is uh, this is Lagnardas strong feeling is coming. Because he loves so much Swami, therefore separation feeling is hankering is more in, increased. They could not tolerate. So this I may say. Maybe so so Okay, thank you very much.